worldly pleasures have also been called mrik trishna in the scriptures which means like a mirage seen by the deer the sun's ray reflecting on the hot desert sand create an illusion of water the deer fooled by the illusion thinks there is water ahead of it and runs to quench its thirst its dull intellect cannot realize it is the victim of deception the more it runs towards the water the further the mirage recedes the unfortunate deer keep chasing the illusionary water and finally dies of exhaustion likewise material energy maya too creates an illusion of happiness and we run after that illusionary happiness in the hope of quenching the thirst of our senses but no matter how much we try happiness recedes from us we see how the well they have enough food clothes for survival and yet they remain disturbed and unsatisfied they see someone else with a better house better clothes a more lucrative job and so there is no contentment these desires can also be compared to an itch when we have an itch it creates an irresistible urge to scratch but scratching does not solve the problem there is only for a while and then the desire to scratch returns with greater force instead if one tolerates the itch for some time the urge to scratch dies down slowly the same logic applies to desires as well the mind and senses throw up mirad wishes for happiness as long as we are in the game of fulfilling them they flare endlessly however when we learn to turn the mind away from material allurements and renounce the desire of the senses we come in touch with the inner bliss of the soul the katha upanishad goes to the extent of saying that one has renounced sensual desires becomes like god yada sarve परमुच्यंते काम ये स्या हृदय श्रीता अथ मृत्यु मृतो भवत यात्रा ब्रह्म समसुनुते व्हेन वन एलिमिनेट्स ऑल सेल्फिश डिजायर्स फ्रॉम द हार्ट देन द मटेरियली फेटर्ड जीवात्मा अटेन्स फ्रीडम फ्रॉम बर्थ एंड डेथ and becomes god like in virtue the god like nature of the soul that is devoid of yearning is also stated in the shrimad bhagavatam vimanchati yada kaman manavo manasi sthitan tareva pundari kaksha bhagavatva kalpate ta person who eradicates wants and becomes situated in a state of contentment becomes like god the bhagavad gita also states vihay kaman yah sarvan pumanch charati nishpraha nirmamo nirhan nirhankara sa shantim adhigachya chati one who gives up all material desires and lives free from a sense of greed proprietorship and egoism attains perfect peace elimination of desire is also the focus of the buddhist philosophy the four noble truths so strongly emphasized by the buddha are one there is misery in the world 2 misery has a cause 
थ्री द कॉज ऑफ मिजरी इज डिज़ायर फोर इफ डिज़ायर इज इरेडिकेटेड मिजरी विल बी इरेडिकेटेड द डाउनवर्ड स्पायरल बिगिनिंग फ्रॉम डिज़ायर does not end merely with anger and greed let us see how far downhill it can take us